Hi, I was just calling to remind you. No, Sammy, you haven't missed a late night feeding. It's just that Emma doesn't like her bottle too warm, and I just wanted to make sure you didn't overheat it, okay? I gotta go. Hi. Hi. Where have you been? Oh, the meeting. I missed the meeting. I'm so sorry. I, I mean, we held off as long as we could, but it was with the governor. No, I know, I know. I just, I, I had something to do so, uh, with Philip. I, I had to go see him at Ravenwood. I'm... How was it with the governor? Great. Yeah, I, I think we're going to get the convention. So well, that's terrific. Yeah. Is everything all right? You've been so anxious to get back up to speed and, and you know, to miss a key meeting. Is I said I was sorry. I, I, it won't happen again. That's the third time this week she has missed an appointment or meeting. It doesn't sound like Olivia. No, it doesn't. I mean, every time I turn around, she just kind of disappears. No, 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 nothing. She's just gone. Any theories? I'm not sure exactly. But whatever it is, it's serious. It suits you, Olivia. Running a business. I always knew you'd be successful. You just always thought I was ambitious. No, not true, actually. When you worked with Richard, you always had your finger right on the pulse of everything that happened in San Cristobal. Above ground and below ground, that makes the mark of a real comer. <laughs> I was just doing my job. Oh, please, you're doing your job. You had connections even I envied. Yeah, no, I, I knew a few people. <laughs> I knew a few people. Yeah. yeah. You know, it makes me think that you're probably still in touch with a lot of those same people. I hear your name come up all the time in conducting island business. What's this about? Is there something going on in San Cristobal? Olivia, I have something to ask you. And it may seem like an odd question and a little bit insensitive, but I'm going to ask it anyway. What if a baby everybody thought was dead wasn't dead at all? A baby not really being dead. Where the hell do you get off, Olivia, Edmund? please, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I know this is a very painful subject, but Cassie and I were recalling the night her baby was stillborn, and the conversation turned speculative. This is about Cassie's baby? Yes. Oh, I, I, you actually think that he could be alive? Well, it, it's highly unlikely, I know, it's just... The more I remember how chaotic it was at the hospital that night, the more I keep thinking it's not entirely impossible. I wasn't the only person on the island opposed to Richard. There were more than a few people who would be only too happy to get rid of Richard and his heir, to remove them from the picture. What, removed alive? Well, it's unlikely. As I, I said, it's just I have to be 100% sure. And then I can drop it all together. Wait a minute, you can drop it? This is this me you're checking into this yourself? Well, I don't want to get Cassie's hopes up. She doesn't know? No. I'm not going to go to her unless I have definitive information, which is where you come in. No, listen to me. You, you can't do this. You have to drop it. Leave this decision for Cassie. Only she can make it. You may think you know what's best, Edmund. But when it comes to children, only a mother knows best. Do you understand? <laughs>